Hey guys, what's going on? You're watching Shade Review, and in this video, we're going to be doing a review of these, the Ray-Ban Folding Original Wayfarers. These are the RB4105 Folding Wayfarers. This particular pair has 50 millimeter lenses. Ray-Ban also does produce a 40 millimeter variant. The pair that I have right here have a matte finish. Ray-Ban does make lots of different color frames for their folding wayfarers. However, I think that my favorite is this matte black frame. This particular pair has Ray-Ban's G15 lens, which blocks out 85% of natural light, blocking out most of the harmful blue rays, and they have a very natural tint to them. These sunglasses are always going to be made in Italy, and they're going to say that in the right temple of the sunglasses. Now on the left side, they're going to say folding wayfair right here, and then they're going to have their serial information right there. The middle of these sunglasses have a metal bridge which really helps give them some support and rigidity. Other than that all the other hinges on this pair of sunglasses are going to be plastic rather than metal. This is going to be one of the select few Ray-Bans that do have plastic hinges in them. The hinges are relatively good quality. I haven't had any complaints with them. They feel really nice and the movement is easy. They definitely feel premium even though they are plastic. These Wayfarers do have the recessed Ray-Ban logo rather than the prominent Ray-Ban logo that sticks out on a pair of original Ray-Ban Wayfarers. And I believe the reason for that is that they don't rub up against each other because when you fold them in, they actually are going to be touching each other. All right, so now we're going to get into the best feature and of course that is the ability to fold. Fold. So if you're outside in a bright sunny day and then you walk into a building and of course you want to take your sunglasses off your face because they're not needed, you usually have around two options. One of them is putting them on top of your head, which can get the lenses kind of smudgy and dirty. Or of course you can do what a lot of people do and just simply put them on your shirt, which can be relatively uncomfortable. And then they can easily fall off. So having the ability to fold your Ray-Ban Wayfarers is really awesome. So I'm just going to fold them in. It takes about a second or two to get them fully collapsed here. And then you can take the small little square case that Ray-Ban gives you. It is a hard case, which is going to really protect your sunglasses. And it has a magnetic lid, which is really cool. You can put your sunglasses right in there and then you can easily place them in your pocket and not worry about them getting beat up or scratched, which is really awesome. And then of course, if you want to put them on, you just easily pop it up, take your sunglasses out, and then just easily fold them out and then put them on your face. It doesn't take long at all. Now, what's really also cool about these Ray-Ban Wayfarers is you can't really tell that they fold. If you look really close, you can see a seam right here where they fold, and of course, if you look on the middle, you can also see a slight seam right there where they fold in, but it's really hard to tell, and they still look really, really good. Overall, I really like this pair of sunglasses. It's probably one of my favorite Wayfair styles. I really like the 50 millimeter lens on my face rather than the oversized 54 millimeter original Wayfarers that I have. I also really do like this matte black finish. I think it helps these original Wayfarers look a little bit more modern and cool. The Ray-Ban Wayfair folding cost $150 on Ray-Ban's website, which is a little steep. However, you can pick them up on Amazon for only $112. So if you guys are thinking about picking them up, definitely make sure to click the link in the description down below. That's going to send you to Amazon. We're going to get the best deal on 100% authentic Ray-Ban sunglasses. That's all we got for you guys in this video. If you enjoyed it, definitely make sure to hit that like button down below as always. And of course, make sure to subscribe to this channel if you guys want to be notified when I release new videos to this YouTube channel. I have lots of other videos just like this one on my YouTube channel. Again, that's all I got for you guys in this video and I will catch you all in the next one.